What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. Um, I'm getting close so y'all can hear me. Um, sorry about the sound issues. This is a free general collective reading for all signs, cast through Sag, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, let it apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages to resonate. Leave the rest. Free general co collective reading. Love you guys so much. If you'd like to donate, it's High Priestess 05. The link's in the description box below. PayPal only, no cash app, no Venmo. It's a very private, confidential way to donate if you guys choose to donate. Love and appreciate each and every one of you guys from the bottom of my heart chakra. If you like to donate, it's High Priestess 05. We're at 13,340 subscribers right now, so thanks so much for all the love and support to the channel. All right, we're going to do it. All right, so these are psychic, intuitive, prophetic messages. One may apply, two may apply, two plus may apply, none may apply. Only you know your specific story and situation, not anybody else. So you plug it in how it resonates. Okay, so the channel message I received was someone is trying to prove someone is an unfit parent, um, trying to prove them mentally incompetent. However, through many shocking series of chain of events, it's actually about to backfire on them in a huge way. Um, they were trying to do it um, by creating a stream of... Um, of these of of the person getting terminated is what I heard. Terminated after terminated after terminated. Uh, termination after termination after termination. However, um there is there is proof on the last one to prove otherwise and it's about to seriously backfire. Also disparaging of the other parent is about to become very significant in this situation. It was a long but strong one, but you plug it in how it resonates. So someone's trying to prove somebody to be an unfit parent. It could be you or somebody you're connected to. But somebody's trying to prove somebody to be an unfit parent, but they're trying to do it because um, it is about to seriously backfire. People are about to come forward soon to the police over serious criminal behavior of the past. It's about to backfire on this person in a huge way. It's about to cause huge public embarrassment. Currently in legal situation. Huge legal embarrassment for the legal person, legal team, and this person. Okay, this person's in current legal um, issues, and it's about to cause huge legal embarrassment for the legal person and team and for the person that's trying to prove this on the other person because it sounds like other people are about to go to the police. Now, you have to plug yourself into the situation and story however you resonate. Are you the person that's trying to, the low vibrational person that's trying to prove the person to be an unfit parent? Are you the uh, other person that's going against this person that's obviously not an unfit parent? Um, or are you the people about to go to the police uh, because of serious criminal behavior of the past? Only you know your specific story and situation, not anybody else. You have to plug it in how it resonates. But so, there's a low vibrational person trying to prove somebody to be an unfit parent, but they're trying to do it through, this person has been, um, it sounds like wrongfully terminated. It doesn't even sound like it's rightful terminations. Prove it through wrongful terminations in the universe. And it sounds like two or two plus of them. But I heard through the last termination, there is some kind of specific paperwork that can prove otherwise. Um, and it's about to backfire on this person and backfire on the situation and coupled with the fact that people are about to go to the police about the situation because it is very, very, very public. Very, very, very public. So public. Everybody knows it. It's a huge embarrassment to the community. Okay, I heard every, 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 everybody knows it. It's a huge embarrassment to the public and the community. So it's a huge embarrassment to the community and the public. And so I think that's why these people are about to go to the police. You might be the people about to go to the police, sir, ma'am. Um, one person is about to go to Child Protective Services. One person's about to go to Child Protective Services. So one of these people is about to go to Child Protective Services and other people are about to go to the police. But it sounds like these people are heavily in the public eye or one of these people is heavily in the public eye. However, that resonates and applies. But this person, this person kept getting terminated and terminated and terminated and terminated. Wrong, it sounds like wrongful terminations. But there is specific paperwork from the last place they were terminated to prove otherwise. But this person is trying to use their string of 
terminations, whether they were wrongful or rightful, but I feel they were wrongful, but you plug it in how it resonates, to prove they're an unfit parent. But I also heard disparaging of the other parent is about to become very significant in this too. So disparaging, of the, uh, disparaging, I'll read it via Google definition. Disparaging, I can explain what it is, but I'll just read it, what it is. Hold on a second. Disparaging, expressing the opinion that something is of little worth or derogatory. So disparaging of the parent. So somebody has disparaged the other parent in this situation, meaning they have express the opinion that the other parent is of a little worth and derogatory. So they have expressed that the other parent is of little worth or derogatory to the child or children. And I don't know about everybody's court paperwork, but in my court paperwork, it states you cannot disparage the other parent. And that is just the truth. So that's contempt of court right there, violating paperwork right there. And I don't think it's this person because this person sounds like they're trying to combat this person because this person's trying to secretly um, or publicly um, prove this parent person is an unfit parent. Um, so I think this person tried to defend them per themselves against this person. This person is the one attacked, basically. I think this person is the one that's been disparaging the other parent to the child or children by um, Demeaning their worth, hold on. Demeaning their worth and derogatory talk against them. Basically, um, mental manipulation of child or children, basically. Probably, maybe it might be child grooming, possibly, depending on the situation. Or Stockholm Syndrome, depending on the situation. But definitely demeaning talk and disparaging of the other parent, which is mental manipulation and abuse of a minor. And that's just the truth. Um, it is about to backfire in a huge way. It is about to backfire in a huge way. And someone's about to make a very, 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 very important phone call to a very, 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 very high level person very soon. This is humiliating to a community. Humiliating. Many shocking series of chain events are about to occur from this. Wow, so we got someone about to go to Child Protective Services down here. Many people about to go to the police about criminal activity of the past of, I think, in this person. There's a reason this person wants to take, uh, prove this person to be unfit parent. Um, and I think they're using, they're obviously using shysty tactics to do it. One, it's disparaging of the other parent. Demeaning talk, derogatory talk towards the child or children about this person so mental manipulation of a child basically and that's just the truth mental abuse mental manipulation of a child and um slander slander i mean you cannot bad talk another parent um unless they're doing something terrible um but you just can't go around just down talking them and that's just the truth um you can't do that i've been a single parent a long time but I heard it's about to backfire. Somebody down here is about to go to Child Protective Services. Many people are about to go to the police. And somebody down here is about to contact a very, 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 very high-level person um, regarding this situation. And many shocking series of time events are about to occur. Soon and quickly. Soon and quickly is what I heard. I heard it's very embarrassing to a community. And I'm sure it is. This sounds like a very public, very public um, court situation. It's so, so, so public. So public. People are mortified. It is so, so, so public and people are mortified is what I heard. So you plug it in, how it resonates. So it's so, so, so public and people are mortified. Well, I'm sure they are, but, but these people help create the mess. Some people are about to try to help, help it soon and quickly. But these people help create the mess, but some of these people are going to try to help, help it quickly. So these people help create the mess, but they're trying to help it now. I don't know. You plug it in how it resonates. This is yikes. This is a hot mess express is what this is. That's why people need to stay out of people's business. And I'm just being serious. That's why people need to stay out of people's business and 
followed by the court paperwork. And that's just the truth. Um, let me see if I hear anything else. I don't feel energy. And people that stole money from a feminine energy in the past through many series of train of events, they're about to get more money stolen from them than what they stole from the feminine energy. Stolen by people they would have never expected to steal it from, from them. And people that stole money from a feminine energy, large amounts of money, large amounts of money. They stole large amounts of money from a feminine energy, I heard. Um, but through many series of chain events, um, somebody they would have never expected close to them is about to steal, I heard, more money than they stole from the Fem Energy. I heard it was large amounts of money. So, um, you plug it in how it resonates. This is terrible. Why are you going around stealing? I'm, I mean, I'm just being for real. Why are you going around stealing? If anybody needs to hear that. Um, I'm not saying it's you guys. It might be, I think it's somebody you know that's done this but you plug it in how it resonates um but whoever is about to steal this money from these people they know they have stole the money from the fem energy and they apparently know where the money is um i'm feeling for a lot of these situations it's not in a bank i'm presuming or the person has stole the bank account number or they know the bank account number how that resonates this is terrible spirit messages here after collective Woman holding a heart attachment. Number 44 or 5 could be very significant numbers in one's life. Number 44 or 5. There is about to be a very significant death in this soon as well. There's about to be a very significant death in this soon as well. Dear Lord. So a very significant death in this too. Um, I... You, I don't know how the death's going to occur. All I heard, there's going to be a very significant death. This is terrible. Um, this is terrible. Number 44 or 5 could be very significant numbers in one's life. Woman holding a heart. A mother is about to really advocate for her children and herself. She knows she needs to do this. And a mother is about to advocate for another mother. A mother is about to advocate for herself in the court of law. A mother is about to advocate for herself in the court of law. I heard she knows she needs to do this. And another mother is about to advocate for another mother. So we have a mother about to advocate for another mother. That could be the one about to call child protective services or the one about or one about to go to the police or the one about to contact a very, 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 very high position of authority and create shocking series of chain events. I don't know. Only maybe you watch my channel, Mother, about to advocate for another mother. I feel you may. Um, only you know the actions you're about to take, ma'am. But I think you care about this situation. You care about the mother. You care about um, good mothers, I'm presuming. Because I think it's this person is the, go the good mother. I think this is the good mother. I heard she's going to go in the court of law and um, advocate for herself and her children because she knows she needs to. So she's going to stay in the court of law. She's going to advocate for herself and her children. Um, because she knows she needs to, because she's under attack, because the person uh, taking her, um, uh, accusing, um, trying to dis um, uh, prove her to be an unfit mother, and, um, uh, uh, disparaging child or children, it sounds like behind her back, she knows she needs to defend herself, basically. I think you know this, mother, and you're about to, um, uh, about to stand up in a huge way. About to stand up in a huge way, I heard. You're about to stand up in a huge way. Advocate for this situation. Advocate for this mother. I don't know how you're going to do it. Only you know, ma'am, how you're about to do this. Um, you plug it in, how it resonates. But this is, heard it's embarrassing to the community, and I'm sure it is. This is terrible. We have attachment. This mother knows this mother cares, and she is right. 
And she knows this other person is very manipulative, and she's right. Okay, so you're highly intuitive, Mother. I'm pulling you in very strong. I heard you know um, this mother cares, and you're right. And um, you know the other person is very manipulative, and I heard you're right. So you care about the situation. You are attached to this situation. You um, care about this situation. I think it's heartstrings attachment. Um, but I think you know about some kind of criminal activity or activities too. Maybe you're the one to go, go to the police. Maybe you're the one to go to go child protective services. I'm not sure. Maybe you're the one going to contact the very, very high position of authority. I'm not sure, ma'am. But um, I think you care about the situation. And I think you know about the crimes of the past. And I think you're about to release them. About to do it very, very, very quickly. They know this was wrong. And it was. About to do this very, very, very quickly. You know this was wrong and it was. So whatever is going on here with this very public, uh, sounds like upcoming court situation, you know it was very, very wrong and I heard you know it was. Your mother in some shape, form, or fashion, whoever you are, ma'am, I didn't hear a sign on you. Only you know who you are, not anybody else, but I'm pulling you in very strong. But they're trying, this person is a um, man or woman over here. They're trying to prove this mother to be an unfit mother, basically. And they're about to go in a legal battle with her. And I think it's a child custody battle because they're fighting over kid or kids. Um, and trying to disparage care kids against this mother. And trying to use a string of terminations to do it. You plug it in how it resonates, ma'am. This is a hot mess express. This core situation is about to turn very, 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 very public very soon. And Arisa needs to hear this. This court situation is about to turn very, 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 very public very soon. And Arisai needs to hear this. The news will probably get involved. It needs to be handled correctly. The news will probably get involved. It needs to be handled correctly is what I heard. So you plug in how it resonates. I heard the news will probably get involved. It needs to be handled correctly. Um, I heard Arisai really needs to hear that. A Gemini Libra Aquarius. You could have Gemini Libra Aquarius in your sun, moon, rising, Venus, ortho, moon, heaven, and Jupiter charts. Sir, ma'am, I didn't hear a sign on you. All right. Well, I love you guys so much. Everybody have a good day. I hope this helped and namaste.